got millions of people homeless. If that's a story that the progressive media and that this conference decided to cancel the panel on, the Katrina panel is the panel that got canceled at this conference. I know none of us made that decision. Let me get your first and last name, please. Boswald Nelson. And uh, tell me about your Memphis native. Where are you from? Uh, no, I'm originally from Massachusetts, but I'm a Katrina evacuee. Am I going back to New Orleans? No. And I believe I say this for a whole lot of people who suffered through the Katrina incident. Number one, I would not put my life in the hands of a man that will not stand up and do what he's supposed to do to get his people up out of that situation. He could have took, taken the buses, commandeered them, whatever repercussion that could have came afterwards, let it come afterwards, but he would have been doing the thing that was right. He chose not to do that. He left. He got on a helicopter with his family and friends and went to Baton Rouge and left us there in New Orleans for the flood to hit us. Okay? Uh, as far as going back there, no. One of the main problems that we have now is that we have a new ethnic group that's been pounced on the black community, which is taking jobs from us. Everyone deserves a job. But the reality is, is do you take people to replace another people? We have jails that they're creating. Who are they for? Because the only ones I see working now are Spanish. So those jails must be for the homeless and black folks. And this is the same trend around the whole country. We appreciate what the churches do in reference to food and stuff. The reality is we need education. I dropped out because I had no family. I had to work because uh, that was the only thing that I ever knew from the age of 13 on. I want to explain to the people, number one, everybody that is homeless, they are not drug addicts. You have a good majority that may be, but you also have people who are just down on their luck. Do you kick a dog that's dying? Because that's what you're doing to the homeless. You're killing us because you won't come forward as one and say, hey, brother, let me help you become a fisher of men. Let me help you find a job where you can take care of yourself and you become a productive member of society. Ain't no one saying that. The only thing that we see today is we're being ripped out of the parks and we're being thrown in 201 Popular Street. Is that your solution to the homeless? If it is, then you got something coming to you. So, you're, 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 is, is that a body channel? Is that what it is? That's my name, man. That's your name? That's my uh, name. That's your name. Mm -hmm. Where'd you get that name, brother? My mom went to Kenya. Okay. When uh, she was in college. All right. And uh, she named me Imani, and she named uh, my brother Salim. Salim. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. oh. So she traveled? She traveled. Yes, she did. Yes, Trying to get away from my father, the story goes. <laughs> she came back to him. So, you know, that's how it goes. Trying to get away, huh? Where the father's Africa? Yep. <laughs>